Welcome ladies and gentlemen, this video is going to show you how to install Flash Player on Ubuntu. It's pretty simple. I'm going to start this video off by going to speedtest.net and you're going to see that it's not working properly because I do not have Flash Player installed. I have my dock set to auto hide but I need to change the sensitivity on it because it's a pain in the butt to get it to open sometimes. Here we're going to select Ubuntu Software Center from our little dock, the sidebar that appears. By default it's there always but like I said I set mine to auto hide. When the Ubuntu Software Center loads you'll need to click on the top right of the screen where the search bar is and type in flash and then you'll need to click on Adobe flash plugin and click use this source it will take a minute but it'll eventually get to another screen where you can press install depending on the speed of your flash drive hard drive or whatever you're booting Ubuntu from uh, it can cause it to freeze and take a while to load some things in this situation we're using the fastest USB 2.0 flash drive in the world it's a Patriot Rage XT reads at about 27 megabytes per second and writes at about 23 megabytes per second but that still causes causes Ubuntu to stutter when running it directly from the flash drive. This screen finally loaded, so all we're going to do is press install, sit back, relax, and wait for it to install. That whole process took roughly about a minute, in 54 seconds up to a minute. Of course I sped up the footage and didn't make you wait through it all. Here we're relaunching the web browser, going to navigate to speedtest.net, and something different's going to happen this time. It's going to load just like you'd expect it to on a Windows or Mac computer. The loading time here is you also got to keep in mind that it is reading a crap ton of data from this USB 2.0 flash drive. So it's going to take a little bit, but in a second here, the screen's going to pop up and we're going to be able to select the server we want. I went ahead and just chose the one with the best ping, let it run, and you'll see the results here shortly. The ping could most definitely be better, but those download speeds are impressive. Approaching 105. Oh, it's going down. It's going down. Okay, so we're hitting about 100 and... Well, dang. Quit going down. Stay up. 104? See? Every time. 101. Okay, so we hit a maximum about 105 down. I've gone anywhere from 105 to 120 down, so that's actually kind of a lower speed test than normal. The uploads, I've hit, in, you know, on an average, anywhere from 20 to 25. On a good day, about 23 average. That's what I usually get while uploading YouTube videos. So, it's pretty nice. I can upload a, you know, 5 gig video in probably less than 30 minutes. So, I cannot complain at all about my connection. Here, I'm actually going to my YouTube channel, and I'm changing a video to HD to see just how quickly it loads. Please keep in mind that this is, you know, running from a flash drive. So everything it's downloading is going onto a flash drive. And that's the bottleneck here. This flash drive is fast, but it's only USB 2.0 and it, it can only go so fast. And it's just simply writing files to the computer from the internet just way too fast. So it's not going to be as awesome as if you're using like a, you know, a traditional hard drive or you know, even an SSD, the video would load so much quicker and more and better. That's it. That's the end of the video. Uh, this was simply just to show you how to install Flash Player. As you saw from the beginning, uh, speedtest.net would not load. If we went to YouTube, it would say you need the latest Flash Player. And installing it on Linux is a little bit hard, but Ubuntu has made it super, super easy. So this was just how to install Flash Player on Ubuntu and get it working just fine. Because most of us use our computer just to simply browse the internet in the first place. That's why Chromebooks are pretty freaking awesome for some people. Anyways, if you enjoyed the video, please leave it a rating letting me know whether you liked it or didn't like it. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. I do mostly Android-related videos, but every now and then I like to mix it up with, you know, cases and accessories and, like, USB 3.0 stuff and Ubuntu and just randomly throw stuff in there every now and then. So, let me know in the comments whether you like this kind of stuff or not. This is What Would Josh Do, and I'm out.